Nicholas Holt's recent collaboration with Nicolas Cage was a $65 million box office flop, but the actor might be able to fix the damage with his upcoming horror remake. Although Nicholas Holt started his acting career at the young age of six, the actor did not land his breakthrough role until his early teenage years. After starring in the acclaimed coming-of-age UK drama Skins, Holt gained even wider recognition, paving the way for his future roles in movies like A Single Man, Clash of the Clans, X-Men, First Class, and Warm Bodies. Like most actors, Nicholas Holt has experienced several highs and lows throughout his acting career. While some of his movies like Mad Max, Fury Road have performed exceptionally well, others like Dark Phoenix have failed to impress audiences. Unfortunately, his recent team-up with Nicolas Cage belonged to the latter category. Luckily for him, however, he will soon be starring in a 102-year-old horror remake that has the potential to showcase his acting forte in a whole new light. Nicholas Holt's Nosferatu movie will make up for Renfield's critical and box office disappointments. Nosferatu already looks more promising than Renfield. Despite having a stellar cast that included Nicholas Holt, Nicholas Cage, Aquafina, and Ben Schwartz, Renfield failed to leave its mark at the global box office. Against a budget of $65 million, the film only earned $26.9 million worldwide before being deemed a box office flop. Even when it comes to critical reviews, Nicholas Holt and Nicholas Cage were commended for their performances. However, most critics were dissatisfied with its extensive CGI usage and forgettable comedy and action. Fortunately, Nicholas Holt's role in Nosferatu might finally help him redeem himself after Renfield's underwhelming performance. Nosferatu is a remake of a 1922 German film of the same name and is being directed by Robert Eggers, who has consistently delivered acclaimed horror movies like The Lighthouse and The Witch. Since Robert Eggers' films almost always land in critics' good books, it seems likely that even Nosferatu will tread a similar path. As Nosferatu's CinemaCon footage suggests, the film also includes other talented actors, like Bill Skarsgård, Willem Dafoe, Lily Rose Depp, Emma Corrin, and Aaron Taylor Johnson, whose presence almost guarantees that the film will perform far better than Renfield. Nosferatu flips Nicholas Holt's last Dracula-inspired character. Nicholas Holt's character is not Dracula's minion in Nosferatu. Nicholas Holt portrays the titular character in Renfield, who is Dracula's enslaved minion, loyally serving him and bringing him more people to feed on. In Nosferatu, however, Nicholas Holt will play Thomas Hutter, who is based on Jonathan Harker from Bram Stoker's Dracula. Unlike Renfield, Jonathan Harker is portrayed as a human character whose fateful encounter with Dracula leads to dire consequences. To escape the Count, Harker even attacks him despite failing several times. Given how Renfield and Harker have contrasting dynamics with Dracula, it would be fair to say that Nosferatu flips Nicholas Holt's Renfield role.